Hi everyone. We at the National Centre for Literacy and Numeracy for Adults have been developing sets of resources for specific industry groups. Now one of these groups is the Core Skills Group, designed for tutors who are working with learners as part of the Youth Guarantee Scheme. Now as we know, the Youth Guarantee Scheme is designed to transition learners into employment by developing their specific trade skills. However, it turns out they also need more general employment skills. So this set of resources is specifically designed to develop the general employment skills of those younger learners in the Youth Guarantee Programme. Now to be sure that these resources were highly effective for the sector, we asked several organisations to give us feedback about the kind of challenges their tutors have in regard to literacy and numeracy with Youth Guarantee learners. And when all the information came back, three main themes arose. The first of these was the need to develop effective CVs, that is curriculum vitaes. And it turns out no matter how good a learner's uh, trade skills, the CV is an important part of getting a job interview and then of course getting employment. So we've put together some resources around writing cover letters, uh, writing personal profiles and so on, and also how to support learners to continue to edit and refine their CV over time so that they'll be able to continue to improve the CV even after they've left your course. The second thing had to do with developing communication skills, particularly verbal communication skills. And it was things like how to introduce yourself in public or even in an informal setting, um, how to have good interactive conversations, how to manage difficult conversations and so on. So we've put together some resources around communication skills. And the third thing had to do with numeracy, and it was an area that's been a little bit neglected in the past, and that is statistics. And tutors had said they'd like some information on statistics, how to teach it, but particularly again at the lower steps of the learning progressions. So not so much around um, measures of central tendency or measures of spread, but really how do we engage learners in statistics so they enjoy it and find it useful and relevant to their lives. So we've put together some resources around statistics at the lower steps of the learning progression that are designed to be interactive for learners and fun and we hope uh, will engage them in statistical thinking. Now we hope that these resources would do three things. The first thing is that we would hope that it would inform your program design. That is, you could sit back and look at them and think, yeah, I think I could integrate these into my yearly program on a more permanent basis. And number two, we wanted to give tutors uh, hands-on and tactile activities that would engage learners in literacy and numeracy. And so they're there for you to be able to use. They've all been used in real classroom situations and they've all been really successful. So we hope that's the case. And the third thing is we would hope that they would stimulate you to think about new ideas that you could use in your class. So you would look at these resources and think, yeah, uh, I think I could actually do this better. And then you would create something even better and uh, it would be really worthwhile for your learners. In the end, we wish you all the best with your tutoring. We really hope these resources are useful in your practice.